Brian Nestle here for the Winter Park Diamond Dogs as they get set for a three-game series against the defending league champion Sanford River Rats. I'm joined by Victor Tan. Victor, thank you for having me today. This offensive outburst, 28 runs in three games for the Sanford River Rats. Explain it for me, please. Yeah, I mean, it's amazing to watch right now. These guys are on fire. Uh, it's led by Omar Villeman, who uh, who won Player of the Week last week for the Florida League and obviously for our team itself. Uh, he went an astounding 8 for 14, had eight runs, six RBIs, and only one strikeout. Uh, it's also led by 28th round last year's 28th round draft pick um, for the Kansas City Royals, uh, Reed Hayes, who is a uh, six for 13, has three runs, seven RBIs, and the only home run for the team so far. So, yeah, it's, it's pretty amazing watching these guys play right now. You had mentioned Omar VMN Player of the Week. Just explain how he, what he's meant to this team so far. Yeah, I mean, he's been fantastic. You know, you talked about coming off a, um, you know, a first-team All-State season last year for uh, St. John River State College, and, you know, so he's just kind of carrying that over from, from, uh, from his last year, and, um, you know, he's doing well this summer. The Diamond Dogs are going to face off against Tyler Checkley starting on the mound for the River Rats. What can we expect to see out of Checkley tonight? Yeah, we saw um, from Checkley he uh, pitched in, um, in, a, in a game against Leesburg at Leesburg. He had 2.2 .2 innings, uh, only one hit, gave up zero earned runs and zero walks. So, um, you know, limited, limited pitching time, but, you know, he'll be, I think, you know, we'll see some good stuff from him tonight. No, you would offense obviously the strength of the Sanford River Rats team. But what can you see go, uh, as like a weakness or something that can maybe throw them off the rails as the season keeps going? Uh, you know what, uh, Katie really talked about hitting and uh, Katie, our coach, Kevin Davidson, talked about hitting and the bullpen really being essential to to uh, success for this team. And, you know, as long as those things, you know, stay up, I guess I, th I think these guys are going to, you know, um, make a good run of the championship again this year. Um, so far, uh, the hitting has obviously been really good, you know, with, uh, like I said, with Vielman and, uh, and Hayes, you know, kind of leading the way. But as long as those things kind of keep up, you know, um, I think these guys have a good chance. Now, obviously, the River Rats play here at historic Sanford Memorial Stadium, which home of the New York Giants as well as the Boston Braves. Players like Babe Ruth, Ty Cobb, and the Sanford River Rats have a very good following. Do you think that's an extra motivating factor for River Rats players here? Yeah, definitely. You know, I spoke earlier in the season with Kevin Davidson, and he talked about having, uh, um, you know, having probably he was so excited about playing and, and, and coaching in Sanford because it, it provides like an environment uh, unlike any other in the Florida League, you know, uh, except for maybe Leesburg, who also has a, a great fan base as well. These guys here at uh, the fans here at, uh, at Sanford provide such a great atmosphere and environment for um, for the players who are preparing, you know, obviously for the draft and everything and uh, for a future a future career in the prof in professional baseball. Well, obviously. I mean, I expect an offensive outburst for Sanford, but Winter Park is at a very dominant staff as well. Three runs in just two games. What gives tonight? What do you expect from this three-game series against the Diamond Dogs? You know, I'm expecting a, a really good series. You know, we have a doubleheader tomorrow after the rain, rain out yesterday. Uh, you know, it'll be a battle between an, an immovable object and an unstoppable force. So I'm, I'm really <laughs> excited to uh, to kind of see, you know, what, what happens, uh, who gives first, you know. So, you know, both teams are, are, are going to put on a show tonight, so... Uh, and, and in the series, so I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to it as well. First pitch set for 7 o'clock tonight. The first of a three-game series, 7 o'clock tonight, 4.30 tomorrow, and 7 o'clock tomorrow at Bishop Moore High School. Winter Park against the defending league champion, Sanford River Rats. I'm Brian Nessel. We'll see you later on tonight.